It is Tuesday. And it's in the woods. But it's actually Monday. It's actually, is it? What? <laughs> I don't even know what day it is. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's the thing. I can't. What happens when I press that button? Let's try it. Wow. I don't know. Nothing happens. Nothing happens. Wow. Oh. Why would well, they have that button? That's, I just have to do this. <laughs> it's Tuesday. Once you've pressed start, you. Uh, that little option goes away. I yeah, guess. it doesn't let you like turn it around. Weird iPhone. That's but on weird... Instagram stories, you can go back and forth. Yeah, During if story. Instagram can do it. Come on. Come on, Apple. Anyway, I'm not <laughs> going to do that for too long because it's, it's going to uh, make you dizzy. It's going to make me dizzy. But we'd, we've decided to do this walk. I'll be totally honest. You, you heard my, my, pod, my solo podcast last week. Um, I said I didn't know if we were going to have one next week. Uh, Tell <laughs> I didn't know the answer to it. Apparently, this is the answer. We're here. Yeah. Um, but look, things are going to change a little bit. Um, well, yes. And it's, that's life. Uh, <laughs> we have some plans and we're going to need... Are you sound like it's a bad thing? Well, I'm not. I'm just... We're shifting I'm, things and it's awesome. <laughs> <we're>, <laughs> this is the... Christina versus Raquel. <laughs> She's like, everything's ruined. Everything's no, a step, no, no, no. and everything's changing, I because sometimes they just have to change. I didn't say no. it. I'm so happy we don't have to transcribe this. <laughs> uh, so just to, to preamble, and we're, when Raquel listens to the podcast, she'll have perspective. No. Uh, <laughs> the reality is um, what we were talking on the, on the drive on the way up here. So we're live streaming uh, for Story Hive, as you all know. Live stream... Uh, and video on demand. And so, video on demand, yes. Um, you guys can actually, so I think this is the other thing I just want to note to interject really quickly, mm -hmm. is I've gotten so many questions about where people can find the live stream. One, it's on VidFlex. If you Google VidFlex Summer Crew, we are Summer Crew 8, so you can find us there. Um, you can also go to my Instagram at the Raquel, well, at the underscore Raquel, as Christina likes to remind me to say. Yes. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I feel like it'll probably show up anyways, but yeah, that's more correct. Uh, it's on my link in my bio, so you can click there and you can find it there. You do not actually have to make the live stream time because they live there for the whole duration of the summer. So you can find it there. You can also, if you're a TELUS user, um, find it on Video On Demand, which is channel 707 for community channel. This is very mucky. I'll let Come you go. Down here. Oh, that's okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm a goat. Um, you can find it in all of these many places. And then I believe someone was just telling me I need to double check this. Or if you guys know, please let me know. There's actually a Telus app that you can download. Really? Yeah. So you can oh. see, even if you're not um, using Telus as your provider <laughs> for your TV, you can also download their video on demand app and watch there. So that was my little introduction, <laughs> my little self promo <laughs> and Good introduction. Job. Thank you. I know that's not easy for you. No. So we've been walking. My my to carry on what I was um, what I was saying is we've been walking up here because of this live stream. Uh, we wanted to do forest bathing this week. There are so many places around uh, Vancouver uh, that you can you can go looking for a good place to to walk and hike and bathe in the forest and listen to the sounds. And I was like, look, we, on the drive on the way up, we said we have to figure out how to continue if we're going to, or put the, uh, the podcast on, uh, on to kind of pivot for the summer where we'd redirect everyone to VidFlex. Uh, Cause it's so a lot loud. of content. So it's... basically we have two hours, if not more than two hours a week that we're that we're creating for uh, Story Hive for Telus, and then with the podcast, it's usually at least another hour. So that's three hours of content, um, and then both of us have our other every other job as well. So yeah. it is a very big stockpile. Um, but yeah, Christine and I were going back and forth on what the best solution was because. We love our community. We don't want to let them down. We want to be here. Well, and we also, like I said last week in the podcast, like 
what happens when you level up? What yeah. happens when you're like, okay, we're gonna go for these really big things and you find a team or you find these fire friends, you find these people to make this thing happen. Yeah. And then you're like, holy smokes, like I'm <laughs> here now and I don't necessarily have the infrastructure. I don't necessarily have like, uh, you know, the capacity, all these things take way longer than we thought. There was technology and, and it's the all learning. Yeah. That's like what, learning yeah. is like this. This so, is, yeah. You know, on top of the content creation, both Christina and I are learning very new skills at this time. Um, and mm -hmm. that takes a lot more, a lot more time for us to, to, you know, create the content that we want to at the level that we're trying to create it at. Um, so I think it's like a triple whammy of being busy, of not just having big deliverables, but also having to learn how to deliver those things at the same time. You have to look at me for the minute. I will look at you. <laughs> there are people coming I, in. I enjoy looking a, at this you. This is about me right now. <laughs> I don't even know. If, I wish there was some little like, I mean, it's again, weird. technology. Put a little display on this side so I can see you no matter which way I spent. It's there like one more display app. to break, I think. Oh. Well, on my end, I'm like a total phone dropper. I bet they were just all up my, my nose just then. You what? I bet they were, everyone was just up my nose just oh. now. <laughs> I don't know what I heard, but... <laughs> <laughs> anyway, oh. it's a long, it's a, it's a bit of a walk down, so, you know, we've got time. Yeah. Um, for those of you who are listening, which is all of you, I don't know if we, we probably put this one on YouTube because it's probably, I mean, jarring because you're watching me navigate, yeah. walking. Sorry if you're dizzy. Down. Yeah, sorry if it look, if it feels a bit Blair Maybe Witch for you. Maybe don't look at it. It's Blair Witch. <laughs> <laughs> it kind of, I mean, it could Grab be. the handheld. I, yeah. It could be. I say that. I've never watched Blair Witch, and I don't intend to ever really? in my life. Oh, my gosh. I we know. Blair Witch. I can't do that. I can't watch. It was such a good movie, and no. I was, like, totally one of those people that was no. like, it for sure happened. I don't like it. And then it, it didn't. Loved uh, it. Anyway, my point is, <laughs> we've... Uh, we think we've got some solutions on the table. And this was the thing I did want to share, actually, yeah. with all of you. Um, all of our wonderful listeners who continuously comment, follow, like, do all of these things. Like, gosh, I, I didn't think to myself that content creation was going to be a thing that we do so heavily. But it's, it really requires <laughs> so much time and effort and, uh, and so much... Uh, what's, what am I trying to say? I don't know. Uh, I'm trying to say that, uh, oh no, I totally lost my train of thought. Like that it's a heavy lift? It's a heavy lift. And what were we talking about before? Oh, putting things on the table. Yes. At, at a certain, thank you. At a certain point, you have to put things on the table and you have to say, instead of saying, oh my gosh. What even, what, what even do we do it? with that? It's grossing me out. Oh, you can put it in my bag. We'll throw it Eey. out. I mean... What's in it, though? I don't want to touch it. We've just found a tough Maybe it's drugs. Is it meant to be there for a reason? Like, is it meant to be there? It's like, oh, it might be trails. It's balloons. It's Canada flags. It's flagging tape. Come on, team. Tiny, shiny changes. Like, what is that? It's, oh, there's Oh, it keys. might be orienteering. Oh, leave it. It could be orienteering. We take that back. This might be there on purpose. I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, um, we have a puppy dog. Oh, oh, there's people everywhere. Oh, here we go. <laughs> All right, well, you can look at the view while we walk past these people <clears throat> that we don't have a license and for. And they're fur babies. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but my point is, we were having this conversation that we were like, we really need to, we really need to figure out the workflow of making, making this happen. Yes. Uh, or putting it on pause, like, you know, and not yeah. be attached to the answers until we've come to what we'd like to, like putting all the ingredients on the table first and then saying, what can, do we have the capacity to make right now? And I think being okay with slowing down to go fast. I think sometimes yeah. we need to take a couple steps backwards, chill out, have mm -hmm. a minute, do the bare minimum, and yeah. that will give us the time and space to come up with the best uh, strategy forward. But yeah. to make really big decisions while you're in a place of stress or, you know, overworking, whatever it is, um, emotional strain, it's not always the best time to make big decisions. <laughs> right. Um, 
And I think really like sometimes we really do require that, that moment to step back. And that's why Christine and I did talk about, okay, do we take the summer off and do we say, we'll see everyone, you know, in September or do we kind of do a bare bones version of this and say, well, we're already doing visual content. So for visual content, they can see us on Vidflex and for audio content, we can do this uh, and still they'll find us everywhere that they normally do. Apple Podcasts, Spotify, you name it. Yeah. Um, but that's been a serious discussion that her and I have been having. Yeah, we've, we continue to have it. I mean, I think we're not at the end of that conversation, but there's this really tricky phase where someone said it earlier, what, you know, um, I was talking to somebody and they said, you know, I'm in the middle of between em emerging. Sorry, we, have a, we have a friend that's oh, like, we have a, there's <laughs> like a little, between little my legs. <laughs> <All dogs>. times. <laughs> um, yeah, we're in the middle of emerging and established. And, and when you do that, you have to like, this is the, this is the peril of being on uh, with, with edge of the desk initiatives. Because at some point they take up a lot of desk space, you know? Yeah. And so you've got to start reprioritizing. Re you you want to build your team. You've got to teeter between like, how much am I going to invest and how much am I going to, how much do I need? How much capacity do I need? How much money do I need? You know, how much do I need to continue to pay the regular bills? Um, and I think that's an interesting time to be living in because we're all in the gig-based economy, whether we like it or not now. And it's a really... It's something that I just, I just don't feel very many people are, are well prepared for when they start out in an expensive city or they move to a new space. And, you know, we we're talking about the whole conversation of how do you afford to raise children? Well, you it's know? like what you said. You can have it all. You just can't have it all at the same time. Larry. So Classic Larry. I think. Larry quote. You know, when I think about things like that, I have. OK, let's just take, for example, when I went to Amsterdam. Right? I had a good job, it was well paying, I had great bosses, I could have stayed there, uh, I could have bought a house, I had enough to put a down payment on a house. Um, everything was swimming along for that to happen. I could have gotten married, I could have done all of those things. I could have just died, I just <laughs> flipped on that bloody rock. <laughs> This is a great idea. Let's do a podcast. Do you remember the time that, was your that we idea. did a podcast? Don't blame me for this. It was my idea. It was 100% my idea. In, all in the name of efficiency. I was like, well, we're walking down the mountain. Let's do this podcast and get, kill two birds with one stone. Kill two birds is not kill Christina. No. I did no. not think about me. No. She's not a bird. Not a bird. She's a human. Um, it's, also, it's also raining, which it's I'm just... enjoying right now. Oh, my uh, God. But... Yeah, so I think... Do you want to pass through that so you can hold on to the tree? Thank you. <laughs> I can hold for a bit if you want. Um, oh, okay. I will angle it over my shoulder so they can see you. Oh, they don't need to. I don't know if they can see you because it's over my shoulder, so I don't know what they're No, seeing, you should but... just point it forward. Forward? Don't point it backwards. <laughs> point it so you can see what you're pointing it at. Okay. <laughs> but you're not ahead of Visuals me. Visuals one. That, that's okay. I don't have to be. You don't get a face. No. Sorry. No. Oh, and now it's lopsided. What just happened? What is with this? It's this the is rig. An upsetting... The rig is doing something. Same anyway, gimbal. it's not even look, a gimbal. Friends, it's a rig. We're not. We're not. You know, we're not. We're obviously not pros. <laughs> yet. I'm enjoying it. We're but... in the middle of it. Oh okay, my god. What so did I, why did I choose this space? Sometimes my you need to take a step backwards in order to go forwards. And I say backwards, but it's not really backwards. It's just you're prioritizing different things. So financially, I couldn't live the same way over the last two years that I was when I was making a great income. I had to take that step backwards and say, this is something that's really important to me. I need the time to do this, which means I can't work and study and travel and do all these things and do bombshells. So what's the most important things to me? These are, so money's gonna have to wait. I will earn it again. Mm -hmm. I now have proven to myself that I'm very capable of making the money I need to make and that I can save the money I need to save. So in that aspect, I'm gonna take a step back and I'm gonna be okay with not earning, you know, the same way I did before, not spending. I mean, 
I definitely <laughs> had holes in things that shouldn't have holes, like socks and pants and areas that they shouldn't have holes. And oh I didn't buy anything new because I was like, well, I have to pay tuition and I need to do this and this and this. And that is the most important thing. So I think... And that's what we have to do. That's what we have to do to do the things we want. I mean, the other option was I could have stayed and I... Oh, that's okay. Um, thank you, though. <laughs> Christina's so... I was like chivalrous, kind of, yes, is that? Thanks. <laughs> I was going to say gentlemanly, and I was like, you're not a gentleman. How do I? <laughs> not <What's> today. The <laughs> word? <laughs> um, but, you know, I think that's where Christine and I are right now, is we are deciding which things are our main priorities, where can we shift things to make space. Yeah, Maybe and we try a V1 of yeah. this type of content. And if it's still too much, then maybe we take a summer break and you guys can all catch us on the live stream. Um, I mean, hopefully you do that anyway, because it's different content. It's and that different was... content and it's so cool. It's highlighting the coolest shit in BC. I will, I should say Vancouver, lower mainland area, because you should see the other live streams too, because they're also all over BC and Alberta. But I mean, we are talking to so many different people and the content is so dynamic. Um, well, it's visual. We're learning how to do like visual, visual things. As right? I was just recording your leg. <laughs> <laughs> and, but it's tough because, you know, when you think about audio, you think about podcasting. We podcasted for over a year, knowing that, yes, if you want to see the talking heads, you can. But otherwise, you know, you're getting what I hope is decent audio um, an audio product. Yeah. And then when we took the live streaming on, it was very much like, okay, now we have this opportunity to level up. But the amount of planning that goes into repurposing content is huge. And we, I didn't think of it. I was more like, okay, well, we've got this product. We may as well like package it in all these different ways. But telling a story for, uh, for film versus just a, like essentially a, a tomorrow's like the future radio show. Uh, yeah, is a totally different thing. And I think that it's really worthwhile figuring out how best that works. Yeah. And that's going to take us a little bit. And I think, yeah, I, I think I'm just feeling kind of grateful. I have so much respect for producers that whoop, <laughs> produce content and plan that part out. Oh, I went the wrong way. <laughs> I got lost. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just think... If you are a producer and you have a brain for this kind of stuff, let us know. <laughs> Get in touch. I'll swap around. Hey. You can go. go back. It's a little like swivelly. It's kind of weird. Yeah, it's this new, this little rig here. I think maybe that thing tightens and maybe that'll stop mm, swiveling. It's, it's already tightened. I checked hmm. that one, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. Anyway, it's we're, like we're in it It's like it thinks it's a gimbal, but it's not. <laughs> We, there's all this technology that we want to learn to use, but not enough time to learn yeah. to use it. We need the time to learn to perfect it, but we don't have the time because we have to create the content. So, well, isn't that just the? That's kind of like every every small or emerging or growing business, right? You're like, what? Yeah. What really? It's a lesson in prioritization. You get to what grow do I with have us. To pay? <laughs> and they get to grow with us. Yeah, yeah, and sometimes like today. It's a bit rocky. <laughs> Is that a joke? Because there's a lot of rocks. I said I did that entirely on purpose. Yeah. <laughs> oh dear. Well, I think for the next week, I mean, you'll see this on Tuesday. If you have any ideas, let us know. Um, I do think that the most important thing for us right now with all the various things going on is, uh, is, and this is for all of us, like, you know, the world's opening up, you've got, in some places anyway, there's still a lot of fear, there's still a lot of divisiveness and, and, uh, and hatred and, you know, a disrespect for nature. And, and I think that right now, whatever you need to go out and do for yourself, balancing that passion, balancing that, you know, that thing that makes you feel amazing with the thing that's going to put food on the table, you know, take... Try, take, try taking everything out and putting it on the table and inspecting it. I love the analogy of the ingredients 
because you can make so many different things as long as you know what ingredients you have. And some days you might have all the ingredients for a salad uh, and, a, a, and a stir fry, and you might find that a salad is way quicker to just throw things together. And that's okay. <laughs> and I think bombshell brunches is either going to be a salad I don't, I'm or a stir fry. I'm not following that analogy. I, you guys have to me? let me know if you're following it. because <laughs> It's a great analogy. I'm, I'm following my own analogy. Listen to this. Sound. I mean, if I want a salad, I'll go out and I'll buy the things I want oh for a salad. Oh my gosh. Yes, there's the person who's got holes in places that they don't want holes. Yeah, nice. Yeah. Look at that. So pretty. Hey, health and food is something I'll spend on. Because I prioritize. Eh? Right. Stick into the theme. <laughs> Health and food. I did. I did go to Whole Foods yesterday, Ooh. and uh, and buy my usual. And that's where I meal prepped. I bought a whole chicken. I got nice. it all stripped and sorted. Love and it. That's what we're gonna have. What we have in our salad that I've prepped. I meal prepped for later. Very exciting. <laughs> I love it. Yeah. Well, um, I know. Christine and I have kind of discussed doing a couple solo episodes. So you might see, I mean, I know you've already seen Christina solo. I'll jump on there solo. Um, we'll talk about some things and then we'll jump in together here and there, uh, wherever we can. And we just want to keep chatting with everyone as much as we can. And otherwise, like I said, you may just have to find us on VidFlex, but we'll let you know either way. We will not just disappear. If you have an opinion either way, also let us know. Oh, yeah. I don't like this rock. They're like, please stop recording podcasts. <laughs> please. <laughs> what I are can't we listen to I anymore. don't want to listen anymore. <laughs> uh, don't tell us that. That's a bit mean. Yeah, don't. Oh my gosh, I was just filming the top of your head. <laughs> this, is a very, this is a very tricky spot. This is tricky. It's been tricky. Tricky. tricky We're doing tricky. a good job. It's Sometimes such a good job. You just got to do the job that you can. Yes. <laughs> uh, and then I think heading into September, we will start going hard with guests again. I think for now, we'll do solo and bring you along for our content creation and what's going on yeah. uh, in our worlds and Please and hit us up and let us know what's going on in your world. And yeah. if you guys are planning something, I mean, let us know. I'm thinking we have so many listeners who have so much going on themselves that is so cool. We've got authors. We've got, <laughs> you know, actors. We've got all of these business owners who listen along. And we want to celebrate what you guys are doing as well. So... Mm -hmm. Hit us up on Instagram. Let us know what you're up to. We would love to stop by and visit you um, and connect a little bit more in person because we're all here in person finally. I know. At this least is, for our BC fans. <laughs> this is a summer of being brave and living full. Yeah. And, uh, and I also I just want to thank the team as well. Our bombshell team has been exceptional. Uh, I know it always, it's always us in front of the screen, but all the people that make it happen behind the scenes. There's just this newfound appreciation every time we release an episode for the people that make this work. So really yeah. important to acknowledge, acknowledge our amazing team. Shout outs to all of you. The and uh, we need some team time to reevaluate and, uh, and get the strategic, oh, sounds like corporate, get the strategic vision <laughs> into effect. That does sound corporate. Okay. Oh, Raquel's leading me down a really weird. Oh, okay. Is it a weird area? This is a weird. I mean, it's better than the slippery rock. I'll be, I'll be honest. Okay. Say bye bye. Bye bye. Thanks for listening, bombshells. In order to continue to elevate, subscribe and don't forget to click that little bell so you can get notified every time we have a new badass brunch. Until next time, stay focused, fierce, and fabulous.